up, you guys? Welcome to Shamrock TV. My name is Robert. This is my wonderful fiance, Clarissa. She made me a really good meal last night, and I figured I'll go ahead and um go ahead and post it. I actually gonna post it after this intro. Um, yeah. Well, we love y'all and um enjoy. Okay, everybody. So this video is a little bit weird because Robert ain't here. He, I guess, he's at work. Well, I don't guess. He is at work. But, um, I want to surprise him with some food when he comes home from work since he worked all day. I know he probably hasn't gotten to eat anything, so I'm going to cook some yummy pork chops, some green beans and peas, some of his favorite baked beans and I'm gonna cook some fried okra too because I love fried okra it's the best some fried okra okay everybody I'll tell y'all what I put on the pork chops I put some lemon pepper and pepper on there this lemon pepper right here and this ground up pepper. The ones you have to like twist to get the pepper out. I love this kind of pepper. So does Robert. But look how good these pork chops look already. Hope he loves it. But I'll be right back y'all. Okay sorry about that y'all. I had to wash my pan. So I can fry my okra. So I'll get the oil. And put it in the pan. This food might be so yummy. So yummy. I really hope he likes it. I really do. He should. He always says he loves my cooking, but I think he just be telling me that because he thinks he has to. But then get out. No, because he always goes back for seconds. And thirds and fourths. So hopefully he really do he really does like my cooking. But I have the oven hot on. It's preheating right now, so I can put the pork chops in there. Um, and then yeah, and then we just gotta wait for Robert to get home. I hate when he goes to work because I miss him so much. Hopefully he's not working too hard today. I know mothers say, he said that they was like really busy and he didn't get home till like really late, really late. So hopefully he's not busy today. Oh, and by the way, I know I probably need more oil <laughs> to fry this okra, but there's a spider in the cabinet, like right over the oil. I don't know if y'all can see it or not, but I don't want to grab it. Mm -hmm. Hey. Mm, she has her some cereal over there and some liver mush she's eating on. Because she wanted something to snack on. I really wish that I had some rolls to cook. I forgot to grab some rolls for this. But it's okay. It's all okay. Because it's still going to be so good. I can probably like heat us up. some, Make some toast. Or something to eat with it. Or we don't have to have no bread at all. It don't matter to me. Um, I'm just hungry. I'm hungry all the time. Y'all, I need my man here. I can't open this. No. I get it open. But if he was here, I can be like, babe, will you open it for me? He'd be like, yeah, baby. And then he'll open it for me. <sighs> Y'all, I have such a good man. I love him so much. He's so good to me. Even though I can give him attitude sometimes, he's still so good to me. I love him so much. Okay, so I just burnt the crap out of my freaking finger. But I got the okra in there. Oh, it hurts so bad. So bad. I'll be okay.
Okay, so this is what the pork chops look like. They look yummy. And then the fried okra. Mm, so good and crispy. Really good. I like them. Okay, well, back to the subject since my phone likes to cut off by itself. Mm, it's so good. And the pork chops are good. Now he's going to make the green beans and the peas. And his favorite baked beans. Woo. And then we should be all set. Give me one second. Okay, so I got the baked beans in there. This has to be so good. Got the pork chops, okra, green beans, and peas, and baked beans. Mm, so good. And I'm probably going to make us some. Okay, let's hope my phone don't cut me off again. But he's probably going to see this like, what are you sucking up for? I'm like, nothing, babe. I really mean it. You are the best, and I love you so much. You try so hard. You do everything, and thank you so much, baby. I know I don't say it enough, but thank you, and I love you. Okay, y'all, so he just got home. I'm going to open the door. My sexy man. Hey, this <laughs> I know, but I can see you. Come look. Really good. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Thank you, baby. What is this? Pork chops, beans, peas. That actually looks really good. And green beans. And green beans. It's my favorite. And some okra. I don't like four pieces of okra because you don't eat okra like that. <laughs> Shouldn't get me sick. Mm -hmm. That is so good. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love you, Bobby. I love you too. Well, you guys, she just made an amazing meal. I just got off work. My feet are killing me, but it was not as busy. Thank the Lord. Shirt did get soaked, though, so um, kind of wet here, but it's okay. But sure right like side. It? Oh, yeah. Very great meal. Thank you. That's really good. I smell, I smell walking in the door, actually. Mm -hmm. I felt really good. Thank you. You're welcome. And she's sweet. Mm -hmm. What she wants to do. I'm just kidding. I feel about like being mean. Why would you want to do that? Mm. Live every day like it's your last. For example, oh yeah, oh my gosh, y'all. She heard you the phone. Almost um, some dude or woman, I don't know who it was. I feel so sorry for them. I know the anxiety was up, and I was hoping they did not hit the bridge. They were spinning out of control. I stopped just in time. She heard it. Like, wasn't it not close? Yeah. I think really she thought it was me work. that got in the wreck. I was like, what is that? They like, almost hit me. I stopped just in time, but then I was stopping to make sure they were okay, but they kind of just sped right back off and went towards the right, like, drifted off. She heard it. I think, did you, didn't you think that was me? Yeah, I thought I even got in the wreck, because he was driving crazy. I wouldn't have to drive crazy if people wouldn't go 10 miles per hour when you're trying to go to work. They got the speed limit sounds free to read 45 or 35. If, you're not, if, if you are not going to go to speed limit, do not get on the road because you're holding everybody or back. Or if you leave for work on time instead of leaving exactly 10 minutes before you go to work and that's how long it takes for you to get to work. But still, though, it's like mm -hmm. uh, it's like your, um, if your boss is like, oh, hey, well, uh, why would you like? I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, there's like three drivers in front of me. Uh, going 10 miles per hour, I can't help it. It's like a, a Flintstone train. Oh, I'm glad so. you're okay. Thank you. And I, hopefully the person is okay. that was driving is okay, too. Yeah, if you do watch this channel, I'm glad you're okay. I'm so glad you did not hit that wall, because that would have been very bad. Yeah, I heard it through the phone. It sounded bad. It sounded like, like a scene off uh, Tokyo Drift. Like, <laughs> literally, that's exactly what he drifted, like, in the circle. And he went this way first, and then his uh, his side almost clipped my driver's side. But I stopped just in time. I was watching it. And my heart was pounding when I was going to work. I was still on adrenaline that I got all my stuff done just in time. And I actually came home pretty early tonight. I know, which I'm so glad. As soon as this food got done, 
His outfit. I was like, I showed Heck up. Yeah. I showed up. Mm-hmm. Thank the Lord, bud. We are about to eat this delicious meal. Thank you, babe, for preparing it. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. so Whatever. He basically has to say that. Why would I think I have to say that? <laughs> because I don't like my cooking. I love your cooking. Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? Mm-hmm. The okra's on there. I question why you put okra in there. I don't know, because I didn't want to eat all the okra, okay, and then, okra. like, he like, where's my okra? So, I was like, well, you don't even eat okra, so I'm just going to put, like, four pieces, and he's going to give it to me anyway. A long, so. <laughs> a long time ago, my mom tried to give me okra. I didn't. I think she did, or I think she made some. My mom made some really good meals, but I just don't eat okra at all, or macaroni and cheese. When I was little, they tried to feed me macaroni and cheese, and I gagged really bad. She knows I don't even eat it. Mm -mm. I can't eat cheese right now either. I don't even ben, like Ben don't like cheese. Every that's time good. I, I don't like the smell I'm gonna tell him it's poison. No. I remember I won't put my daughter Emily. Well, didn't even want to eat macaroni and cheese. I think because Daddy wasn't eating either. Mm hmm <laughs> But anyway, Ben probably don't like cheese anyway because he don't even like it right now. I can't even smell it. Not feel nauseous. It smells horrible. It smells like a butt crack. <laughs> I, I love cheese. I love macaroni and cheese. I can just, I can eat block cheese, any kind of cheese, like the square cheese. I love making grilled cheese sandwiches. But I can't drink it because Ben don't like it, which is okay. Good boy. Daddy's going to tell him it's nasty and don't eat it. No. Don't make you say small ain't for... cheese healthy for you or something like that? They say a lot of things, are, the things that are healthy for you are, not, are the ones that are really not healthy for you at all. Coconut See, he knows. Yeah. Even he knows. <laughs> no. He said. He said, quit picking on mommy. Just, just like off a of big daddy. He said, this guy knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> He's a good boy. He ain't gonna eat no cheese. Mm -hmm. Please don't feed him that nasty poison. <laughs> I'm gonna try it when he gets older. So if he likes I'm gonna it. laugh if he spits it back out. He I'm just, like, he goes, like your daddy and eat it. <laughs> <laughs> because you eat it on pizza. I can eat pizza, yeah. I don't know what it is, but I can... Oh, I can destroy pizza. Yes, but. So, what's the difference? There ain't no difference. It all tastes the same. No, no it I isn't. think he can eat, what's it called? Um, The white cheese, the uh, mozzarella cheese, is that what it's called? Yeah. But when it's the so yellow too. cheese, like the cheddar cheese, I don't think he likes that cheese. It makes me gag every time I try to eat it. Like, even mm. the smell of it makes me really nauseous and sick. Like, all my family. Um, okay, my mom, my grandma tried to give it to me a long time ago. I would not eat it. Everybody else could eat it at the table. They thought I just didn't want to eat because I didn't want to eat. I did not like it. It's mm -mm, disgusting. I did not like macaroni and cheese. And I would not eat it. You can't pay me enough to eat that. I don't care. What if somebody paid you a million dollars? Oh, I'm smashing just it. <laughs> oh, I, I'm keeping it down until they walk away. Is that a question? Whoever want to challenge me to eat macaroni and cheese out there for a million bucks, come find me. <laughs> Personally. I would destroy it. What about if there's like a big old pot, like one of those pots that your mama has, like really big, and you have to eat it? Oh, I'll like I guess I'm about to get started. <laughs> million dollars? What? I'm about to get started on it, too. Ew. Oh, I'll eat it all. I don't care. Mm -mm. you be constipated. I'll, I'll take it. A <laughs> million dollars? What? I'll take that. I'll take that constipation any day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Right. But look well, at this. I'm ready to eat. Yeah, we are ready to eat, you guys. Um, I've been cooking for hours, and he don't even appreciate it. Oh, style. I love it. It smells good. I walked in the door. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Well, you guys, um, this is going to be it for this video. Love you guys so much. God bless you. Thank you so much, so much for watching, and, um, that person, woman, or man who are almost wrecked today, I'm glad you're okay. You did not hit that wall. Like, I was praying and hoping you were not going to hit it because I know that would have been real bad. But I know your anxiety was up because I know I got in a break a long time ago. And she'll tell you, I don't even like driving. I get worried driving. Even if she, even when she, oh, wait, oh sorry. Sorry, guys. I, it's been a long day. But um, <laughs> she, she'll she tell you, even when she used to drive, trying to drive my car, what would I do? I'll freak out. Yeah. Well, see. Not too long ago, what was it like, about a year ago, I got in a wreck, this man hit me when I was stopped at a stoplight, and then he called me a stupid bitch. Well, B-I-T-C-H, sorry, <laughs> but um, for like no reason, oh, he's the one that hit me, I was stopped, and that's why he got his tag taken and everything, too, when he called the cops. Oh, no, I, that's karma. 
I found that hilarious, actually. I don't know why he got mad because like he was trying to squeeze in it. Like there's a car right there, and I stopped like right there, like right behind the car, and he tried to squeeze his car right there, and it like lifted up our car. It was bad. I haven't driven like drove by myself ever since. Yeah, I don't blame me. That's why I don't like driving. People cannot drive. They either go slow or they drive wild. They cut you off. They don't pay attention. That's who's on like driving. You gotta be careful out there. Plus, it was scary too. Like that freaking man, like cussing me out for like, no reason. He only did that is because of one of the men in the car. Because if I was in the car, he wouldn't have done that. I'm sorry, but no. For all my friends out there that are watching this and family, y'all know. Mm -mm. But see, before he knew what was going on, because he knows how I don't like nobody cutting in front of me. He thought I hit my gas and made him hit me on purpose when I did, and I was stopped. Like completely stopped and he hit me. Okay. I kept saying, I was like, babe, no, he hit me. I was freaking out because I wasn't with her. And then she told me the guy's calling her names. So I told my mom, I was like, give me your keys, I'm going. This dude is not going to say her call names and he better hope and pray to God he is not there by the time I get there. I mean, I don't try to talk violent. God forgive me. But you ain't going to sit there and call my woman names. I mean, it's disrespectful for a guy to sit there and disrespect a woman, sitting there calling her names. I use profanity to her, yelling at her, raising your voice. You don't do that. And like I just said, and anybody anybody who watching this will tell you the reason why he did that is because another man wasn't in the car. I yeah, bet you. But it backfired on him because when the he he's the one that wanted to go call the cops, and I was like, okay, so we went pulled over and he called the cops, and she ended up taking his tag, and I think he got a ticket and like everything, like that's what he gets. And she told me I was free to go because she was like, that's illegal anyway. You're at a complete stop, and he's not supposed to cut in front of you. You're supposed to wait until they go and then like get another lane, like. That's the only reason why he... I don't know. Well, like I said, that's car on him, and he only did that because of one of the men in the car. Ten bucks, since if it was another man in the car, he would have kept his mouth shut the whole time. Yeah, but like I was saying, I was like, you're the one that hit me. I was like, you're in the wrong. That's illegal. Yeah, but see, that's what Carmen does. See, and you got your cat, and you got your tag token. Mm -hmm. Got your tag token, got a ticket, and you had to drive home without a tag, and you probably don't even have your tag till this day. You probably still got your license token. And that's what you get. You don't sit there and use profanity towards a woman and raise your voice and call her names. You don't do that. Like, if I was in the car, it would have been a different no, story. I was on my way to work. Yeah. But if I was there, it would have been a different story. But we all about to smash this food. We are starving. Thank y'all so much for watching. Please don't forget to like. Subscribe. Share. share. Good night. And let's probably never get so lucky.